All right, guys, it's time for my review on these. And they are the V Call. Uh, well, they, they're down as Smarter V Call uh, CSR uh, headphones. And they, you know, they are meant basically as a fitness headphone, you know, for in the gym and stuff like that. And apart from the colour, you know, it's fairly sort of, you're going to either love it or you're going to hate it. Um, I'm quite liking seeing the uh, the bright colours added to some black these days. Uh, it makes a nice change from just plain black or plain blue or do you know what I mean guys? It's uh, it's quite refreshing. Uh, I maybe wouldn't have gone with the the clear tips and rubber bits and what have you. You know, they might have been better done in the green as well, I think. Or maybe even another contrasting colour, I don't know. So we'll have a quick look around them. Controls are very sort of straightforward you do get a little bag as well by the way uh, i think i mentioned that in the uh, early unboxing nice little bag little sort of felt affair uh, but if we have a look at them and you've got it's all plastic construction and you've got that green there a little um light there a little status like that so, you know your blue and your red light sort of tells you what it's doing pairing all that sort of stuff power uh, you've got one rocker switch on there come on focus and it's got basically all that does is track skip and volume strange thing about the volume was i don't know whether it's a glitch uh, when you turn it up on here the phone would always stop one bar under the max even though that was bleeping saying it's hit the max and then you could turn it up on the phone but i mean i always tend to turn it up on the phone and just uh, you know because some of them have separates this one isn't set this one doesn't have like a separate volume whereas some devices do they keep the volume separate so you can turn it up on the phone and then play with the the thing there or you can just use your phone volume i tend to turn everything up to the max and just use the phone volume it's it's far easier than messing about with the switches usually um but you've just got, and then the power button is this one here and it's just that and if i in fact, I've pressed it. You can see it's already gone into like a, a pairing mode there. It does auto connect, but if I just turn that back off, there we go. And you do get um, audible inside, uh, saying headset connected, that sort of thing. Um, nice green flat cable. Uh, not it doesn't tangle at all i have not managed to get that to actually tangle so i'm actually quite impressed with that because normally they do sort of tangle a little bit and an open port for charging which is a micro usb of course and that's uh, there's no flap on it or anything like that so they're not going to be waterproof at all guys but um you know they're, they're perfectly you know perfectly usable microphone okay quality just what you'd expect from these sort of things and that's where things get a bit interesting uh, sound quality for listening is absolutely fantastic for such a budget priced headphone uh, I'm not even sure what they are right now they're about 15 to 20 pounds something like that they're, they're, they're just not expensive at all guys sound quality is absolutely outstanding at this price point so absolutely fantastic for listening to your music too um it doesn't even sort of like buckle under the bass which really shocked me i've got one negative with these and um, it's sort of annoyed me a little bit in so much as because the sound quality is probably the best i've heard in this price point um for some reason the right one wasn't staying in my ear I've tried all the different size tips. Uh, the two, you get another pair of these that I've tried as well, and I've tried all different orientations of it, and it doesn't stay in my ear. Um, is that the right one? Hang on, no, that's the right one, sorry. Um, I don't know, guys. It, it must just be my ear or something. It just doesn't stay in my damned ear. Um, lovely and comfortable, you know. It's comfortable when it's in, but for some reason, I don't know whether it's like the smoothness of the silicone or what. I mean, you know, they've got they've just got these little see-through sort of silicone tips. You know, I mean, they're, 
but they are a lovely lovely little device so uh, I mean if you're in the market for some budget earphones definitely give them a check out guys I mean obviously if they fall out you're gonna have to send them back <laughs> um, I don't know no idea why I did it maybe it's just my ear uh, it probably is you know I mean we're, we're all different aren't we but definitely well worth a check out for just for the sound quality alone guys uh, so that's the smarter v call uh, CSR headset Bluetooth 4 wireless ear tips uh, you get about four to five uh, hours listening out of them you know pretty uh, sort of average across the board you know four or five hours listening sometimes a bit more depends on how much you've called and stuff like that um, and about hour and a half two hours to fully charge them so definitely give them a check out guys all right so big thank you to uh, v call for sending them out for uh, review and i'll see you guys in the next video cheers guys see you